Hey, how's it going guys? It's Sodar here, and today I'm bringing you guys a brand new video. Um, this is for people that keep commenting on my, uh, my how to fix black screens, um, video saying it doesn't work or, uh, that you couldn't get it to work. Well, um, I'm going to show you an alternate method today, but, uh, keep, bear in mind, this isn't a proper fix. Like, I, I saw that it worked for most people, and I'm glad, but, uh, it's not really, it's not really foolproof, I guess. It still may not work sometimes. But anyway, I'm going to show you another way to uh, another way that you can try if that doesn't work. I will also link this video into that. And uh, yeah, so and if you're still going to come in here and ask where the fuck's the auto lobby, that should be released. Uh, I'm pretty, I'm almost done with it right now. I'm just uh, trying some more harebrained shit that will never work. But um, yeah, so working on that uh, should be released either today or tomorrow, or well either the day that this video goes up or the next day maybe the same day I have no idea uh, hopefully it's going to go up right after this hopefully uh, that's if everything goes to plan but yeah I'm after I'm done with this video I'm gonna go work on it but anyway uh, so yeah what you're gonna wanna do is scroll over to settings and scroll all the way down to debug settings and now uh, you know what I'm gonna do a, uh, a two-in-one I guess just because the other one won't take long at all um, what you're going to want to do, uh, this is for people if you get, whenever you try to sign in or sign up for a PlayStation Network account, it says uh, that the connection to the server timed out. Now keep in mind this is only if, you, uh, if you're trying to sign in and it says that, or not sign in, like if you're going to create a new user and then you try to go sign in and it says, or create a new account or whatever, it says uh, that the server connection timed out. You're going to want to head into your debug settings and go to this setting right here, NP Environment. Uh, if you're having that error, it's more than likely going to be SP-INT. Now, what you're going to want to do is just ch uh, click on it. It will bring up this, and you can just change it to change it from NP to uh, or change it from SP-INT to NP. It could be lowercase or uppercase, doesn't matter. But yeah, once you set that, um, you're good. You should be able to go ahead and sign in. And uh, now we're going to go back to the main point of this video. Um, you're going to want to go here. Uh, it says release check mode. It's in development mode right now, which is uh, notice. Uh, just a quick note: you cannot RTM while you do this. You can do CCAPI still, but you can't use uh, Target Manager. So just bear that in mind. If after uh, after you do this, you can't RTM, just remember to change this back to development mode. You're going to change it from development mode to release mode. I'm not going to do it since I don't have black screen, but well, you know, what? I'll do it anyway because I can just change it back. Click on release mode. It'll say uh, to reflect settings, restart, restart the system, but don't do that just yet because there's another setting we have to change. So go back, and then you're just going to scroll down some more until you find this, boot mode. Um, you're going to change this from system software mode. Uh, make sure you don't go to debugger mode. Debugger mode will, uh, if you have a PVR like me or just a high-resolution TV, it, nothing's going to show up at all. It's for developers only, like little, little, hold on, I can't talk literal developers not uh, debug or anything like that it's just literal developers so yeah don't fuck with that uh, just change it to release mode and just set it as release mode and then uh, reboot your system but this is another step for people if they can't sign in or they're getting errors that aren't related to anything else or can't sign in or the debug setting or you can't uh, use RTM tools they won't connect they won't attach anything like that you're going to go right here to network settings for debug, right? And you're going to change this from single, or not from single. You're going to leave it on single. If it's already single and you still can't connect and attach, make sure you have a debug eboot or something along the lines of that because uh, this is usually the setting that people fuck up. And, um, or, well, not that people fuck up, but it's usually on dual. I'm pretty sure it's the default is dual, and you just want to change it to single. So, yeah, just change it to single, and, uh, yeah, that's pretty much it that's all you have to do so uh, once you have those options set you're just gonna restart your system I'm not gonna do that because I don't need to but once you turn it back on uh, I'll give you an example actually here I'll give you an example right now uh, right here I'm just gonna leave it at, or well here you know since uh, since it hasn't reflected yet 
If I go over to games, uh, where is it? I don't remember where I have it saved to. Right here, God of War Ascension, right? Uh, God of War Ascension, hold on. Let me turn this down. Alright, yeah, so, um, so it doesn't work. God of War Ascension doesn't work for me at black screens unless I have that. Or, well, let me take that back. You can play up until the main menu, and, yeah, for, that's me for God of War Ascension anyway. I have to have my settings like that. And I'm not going to show you because I just realized that's going to be a pain in the ass and most people aren't going to watch that long. So, yeah. But anyway, that's how you fix it. Uh, it's, well, that's another way to fix it. This isn't guaranteed. This isn't 100% foolproof. You, there probably won't be an 100% foolproof way for you to fix uh, every black screen that you may get. So just bear that in mind, but it's just something else for you guys to try. So yeah, I hope this uh, video helped you guys. And uh, yeah, Auto Lobby hopefully should be up today, uh, the same day that this video goes up. I hope, anyway. And, uh, yeah, so hope you guys enjoyed the video. Uh, I got some more stuff coming soon with Minecraft and the like. So, yeah, I'll uh, see you guys in the next video.